All right, we're looking at the Aver TV Media Center Upgrade Kit. Uh, very nice little TV tuner card if you're on the market to get a TV tuner that can do both digital and analog signals uh, and can also input a composite or an S-video. This is exactly what you want. Uh, this is actually very versatile. It's a really nice uh, card. What's cool about it, again, is that it is dual, uh, dual band. So you see right here, it's going to convert in uh, NTSC or ATSC signals. Uh, no problem, which means you can do both analog and digital. It's also got right next to it over here this little S-video port, and that's basically going to get you uh, to bring in maybe an old VCR. It also can convert to a composite, which is also very cool. It means you can uh, convert those old VCR tapes into a DVDs or just you know store them digitally, save, uh, save and protect all those old memories. It's kind of cool. Uh, it also uh, comes with a very nice little Media Center remote control. Of course, this is completely compatible uh, with Windows Media Center. If you want to run it with the Windows 7 or the Windows Vista versions of Media Center, it will work as well as with the older uh, Windows XP Media Center edition, uh, which makes it very convenient. That means you can record, you can watch, you can pause, you can rewind all sorts of TV, uh, live TV and live video signals that come from other places as well, so like, such as a DVR or VCR. Uh, and basically, you can record them on your computer. You can catalog them. You can record them. It's really, really nice. If you've never used Media Center, it's a very cool little part of your computer, and you should definitely give it a try. You can also use aftermarket Media Centers, uh, like Boxy uh, is a good one, and I think their Apple has one as well. Uh, so very nice little product. Um, also comes with, just so you uh, know what you're getting, a IR receiver. This is what you're going to plug into the back of your computer. It also has IR blast reports here in case you're going to use multiple remote controls and you want to combine them into one. You're going to use the IR blasters. Uh, that's very convenient as well. It's going to kind of consolidate everything. Uh, it's also important to note that on these tuners, they do support ClearQualm. ClearQualm is the unencrypted digital cable uh, that comes out of your wall. So basically, if you don't pay for a cable box, you just have the regular channels, you can plug that cable directly into the back of this and you're going to get all those channels on your computer. Uh, with no problems. Now, that does not work with the encrypted channels. So if you're paying for HBO or for any types of other channels, it's not going to work. Uh, but everything else will work, and it will work in high def as well, just so you know. This is, uh, if you do know the new digital standard uh, where you plug in your antenna here, digital antenna, you know, they changed the whole changeover thing. It is HD, 1080i. It looks really, really nice. This will support 480p, 720p, or 1080i. So you are going to get a full high def. Uh, experience when you buy one of these, so very, uh, very nice. Now, I want you guys also to note, see this right here? It's PCI Express X1. That's how it's going to connect to your computer. Now, uh, if you don't have a PCI Express X1, it will also work in just about any PCI Express slot as long as it's PCI Express or PCIe. So basically, if you have a 16, X16 slot, it can fit just in that first part of it and it'll work, or it'll fit in an X8 slot, an X4 slot, or finally where it's meant to fit, which is the X1 slot. Uh, so most computers do have that and it does work uh, no problem. So uh, very nice card if you're in the market for a uh, TV tuner. It's going to do both digital and analog and also have a composite in so you can bring in some old uh, VCR or DVD footage that you want to put on the computer. Uh, this is the perfect card. It does work with Windows 7. It works with Windows Vista. comes with a remote control and it's at a pretty good price. So it's the Avermedia. It's actually, the model number is actually the MTV COM G2M G2, but you can refer to it as the AverTV Combo Media Center Upgrade Kit. If you have any questions on it, feel free to email me, and I'll see you guys next time. If you want to get some more information on the Avermedia AverTV Combo Media Center Upgrade Kit, type in A46-2510 into any major search engine. For Computer TV, I'm Albert. Yeah. <laughs>